Today, we're going to create two parts in part design and then combine them in assembly design. First we need to open part design. Click on the compass and launch the app. Rename your physical product. Right click and select properties. Type part 1. Rename your 3D part. Right click and select properties. Type square hole. Once the part is named, click the position sketch button on the lower task bar. Before we start sketching, we need to choose a plane to draw on. For this example, we choose the XY plane. Click rectangle in the lower task bar and create one of 100 mm. Click circle and create one of 20 mm in the middle of the square. When you are satisfied with your rectangle shape, press exit app. Next we're going to make the shape 3D. Click pad in the lower task bar to create the volume. We want it to be 20 mm. Click OK. Use the arrow next to the plus in the upper right hand of the window to save the project. Use the plus symbol to create another 3D part. Rename your physical product in part 2. Rename your 3D part in screw. Same as the first part, use the position sketch button. Select YZ plane. Select profile and draw a screw shape as shown on the screen. Press exit app. Click shaft in order to create a shaft by rotating a profile about an axis. Select the one as shown on the screen and click OK. Use the arrow next to the plus in the upper right hand of the window to save the project. Use the plus symbol to create a physical product. Rename it in assembly 1. Go to the product modification menu and click insert existing 3D part. Go to each tabs and select your two parts for your assembly. Validate your choice by clicking the green checkbox icon. Go to the assembly menu and click engineering connection. Right-click and insert coincidence. Select the two axes in red. Right-click and insert contact. Move your parts to select the faces as shown on the screen.
Congratulations, you are done.